schools and one half of it is Ann Arbor schools. So there's a, it's on a golf course and I blogged on the golf course a couple times. I've blogged on sales in Stonebridge. I've blogged on different events happening in Stonebridge and now I have two positions on Google page one for Stonebridge. So what's happened from that? Okay, one day I'm sitting at my computer and I get a call from a guy in California who says to me, I read your blog. Well, because I have several now, I said, oh, which one was it? And he goes, oh, I don't remember the name of it. I said, well, was it kind of maize and blue because I'm a big Michigan fan? Um, and he goes, yeah. He goes, uh, I'm a cash buyer. I want to buy my father-in-law a $500,000 house in Stonebridge. Um, and that seems like it would be a really good fit for you from what, you know, I've read on, on your uh, blog. So he came into town. His wife is actually from Ann Arbor. They live in California. And he's a venture capitalist, so cash obviously wasn't a problem. And we've taken his dad out and looked the one time, and they're coming back. And I just have a great relationship with them now. That was from blogging on Stonebridge. The other thing that happened is um, I got a phone call one night from a guy, and he said, I need to sell my house in Stonebridge. And that was like a $700,000 house. So I talked to him. Uh, anyway, they don't live there anymore. I don't remember where they've moved. But we started talking, and I found out that he had been paying non-homesteaded taxes on that house, even though it was his, still his primary resident. So because he had had his mail forwarded, the township picked up on it and said, okay, we're charging you. So now I've worked with him. Uh, we talked about it. He got people in there to rent, and we're going to put that house on the market in the springtime. Okay, so just from blogging about little old Stonebridge in Ann Arbor and Saline, Michigan. So if you, yeah, did you ask? No. Oh, so if you, if you pick out a neighborhood that you know a lot about and just blog on it, You'll, you'll get really good position, and those niches are far more money-making for you than blogging just about Ann Arbor, Michigan. Do you know what I'm saying? I, one of my most popular posts I ever did, and like what kind of business did I get from it, but I blogged on the smoking ban in Michigan.